Alrighty, so here's an update on my gaming computer. Well, I set up over there where that um, computer is now, and uh, didn't quite work right. What happened is, installed the operating system on it once, didn't really install or boot correctly. Tried it again, booted correctly, installed and booted correctly once. Then I had a USB failure, probably probably because of the motherboard. And then it wouldn't start up right again, so I restarted it again. And tried installing it again, but then it wouldn't start up at all. Just like, the lights would flash. So, I think it's the motherboard I got. I have a crappy motherboard. Well, one thing that could cause all the restarting is that um, this computer comes with these temperature readers and uh, I originally put the heatsink down on the processor and I took it off a couple hours later and put these little heatsink and these um, heat measure things in and that probably messed up the thermal grease in there so that's probably why it's shutting down so much so what I have to do is we're going to have to get the thermal grease off of there and off of there find some new stuff, put it in there and um, hopefully it'll solve my problems. If it doesn't, then I'm gonna have to get a new motherboard or something. It'll take forever. But that's pretty much what's going on. I'll tell you what I've got in here. I made another video you know, explaining what you know, it has, but I have a couple parts that I didn't tell you I would get. I have an Intel um, uh, Ethernet card. Alright. And we tried multiple Ethernet cards, including hooking the Ethernet into the back of the motherboard. None of it would work. It was not picking up the Ethernet until we tried this thing. Alright, I have a PCI slot cooler. I can't really see that too well, but... You know, it really does a good job of sucking the air off the video card and shooting out the back. It's turbine-ish. 